The number one rule people need to follow is never ever play with a single dime that you cannot afford to lose. Uh, there is no such thing as a really as a as a get rich quick scheme. A lot of people jump into this market and they think, oh, you know what? I'm going to get in here and I'm going to make all kinds of money. The fact of the matter is, when people get into any aspect of the market, you're swimming with sharks. You're going to be in an environment you're that's very hostile to you. And and there there's always two sides of a trade. So let's say you know you're getting in here and you're trading off of let's say headline news or something along those lines, you're probably going to end up taking a hit. Look, we all learn more from our failures than from our successes. I have made and continue to make uh, errors, um, hopefully keeping these to a minimum. When I first started getting into this, see, I got really lucky, though. I mean, and, and, and this is part of the reason why I think I do what I do for a, a, a large degree. When I first started getting into the markets and trying to learn them, um, I kind of fell into a situation where I had people that were willing to help me learn what was going on. Um, you know, just make the broad ske sketches for me. And then, you know, you get in there and you figure it out for yourself. And the other thing with regard to trading or investing is you can get two guys, one sitting next to each other, and they're trying to make sense of what's going on here. Uh, and one guy is going to get it. One guy is not going to. So there are a few general rules that I follow. Number one, absolutely never never invest or trade a single dime that you can't afford to lose. Number two, don't listen to anyone. Listen to your own intellect. Follow the data. It's not too hard. You know, find someone, let's say yourself, myself, that you are fam you're familiar with that you can connect to. Okay, you know what? This guy, he's telling me a story and I can understand what he's saying. Uh, so th that's, that's a big one too. try to find like a mentor if you could, you know, I like to think in many ways that what I do, and I get this feedback from people all the time, well, Greg, you're like a mentor to me, I follow what you're, do you're doing, and it makes sense to me. If, if you're following someone who's willing to teach you, and it, that's a gift, I think, in itself. As long as these people aren't like, oh, you know, I, you know, you got to uh, do this for me. No, 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 no. Uh, a lot of guys like my, there's a lot of guys like yourself, myself, are out here trying to make a difference, and and I think that's what it's really, really all about. So find find a mentor, someone that you can trust, that you believe in. Never invest with any money or trade any money you can't afford to lose, and 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 never stop learning. Um, like for example, me, I follow the markets around the clock, around the freaking clock. I know it's insane, but I feel like it's important for me, especially because I have a reasonably large audience. I want to give people information that that is correct and that they can act on. All right? And it really gets under my skin when you got like a really big guy, let's say Jim Cramer, okay, uh, out recently uh, calling a top in crude oil, which was ridiculous. He has a massive uh, following there and he's steering people in the wrong direction. Um, you know, obviously we surpassed his so-called, we pulled back a little bit, we surpassed his so-called top. Crude's going much, much higher. But, but again, I think the general rules with, with trading are don't, like I said already, uh, never stop learning, you know, don't play with the money you can't afford to lose. And people are going to do this, no matter what you tell them, people are going to go out there and sell their car or take a mortgage against their house, uh, just to participate in, in the market. We have margin debt today in the stock market or money that's borrowed, people are borrowing to participate in the market at all time record high. So when this thing does roll over, roll over a lot of people are going to get hurt badly. Uh, it, it's, it's a really crazy situation. Never get into anything, anything at all that you don't fully understand.